Once students submit work to the teacher, they'll see those responses each time they open that activity. So you can see here, these are just example responses, but every time I open this activity, I'll see my responses listed. If you want students to reattempt an assignment, you may want to clear their page for them. It's really simple to do that from grading and results. We'll click on the teacher's panel, then the graph icon to open grading and results. Here under requires grading, if I click on a class name, I can then click on a student's example or a student's responses here, and then click reset. This will reset the activity for the student and it will not archive the responses. If you prefer to archive those first responses, you would first want to grade any teacher graded activities here under the, the requires grading section. So first we would grade this activity. Then we would open activity results. From here, we'll choose a class or classes at the top, and then the unit or chapter where the activity is that we'd like to reset. From here, we'll have two options. We can choose to reset archive all, that will clear all of the work for the students that are listed and archive their responses. You could also choose just one student by clicking on the student's name, then scrolling down and clicking Reset Archive. That will, again, reset the page for the student, but will save and archive those previous submissions for the teacher to go back and view. Of course, once you've done this, you will want to check the settings on your assignment just to be sure that it's still open for students. So we'll click on the Assignments tab here, then choose the assignment that we want to reopen and click Edit Assignment. There's a couple of things you'll want to check once you edit the assignment. You'll want to check that the due date is either in the future or is set to open-ended. A soft deadline will not allow students to resubmit after the due date. The submission limit can be set to one um, if you've already archived the responses. If you prefer not to clear the page but reopen just the assignment, then you would want to go ahead and set that attempt at one higher. You'll also just want to make sure that the allow review is set either to after due date has passed or teacher controlled not yet, and that the correct answers are not currently showing. That way the students will be able to type and edit their answers still. Once you've checked all of these settings, go ahead and hit Save Edit, and now the students will be able to reattempt the assignment. If you run into any trouble, of course, don't hesitate to reach out to us using the question mark icon within your account.